Hello, and welcome back to the world of Arklands and to Mize Academy. When we last left our heroes in training, they concluded their second mission. Accompanied by the headmaster, they were able to uh, recapture the warlock that they had defeated and uh, kind of figure out finally what he had done and uh, kind of undo it, um, dispersing the paranoia amongst... Did we, though? <laughs> yeah, they're Elden. expecting everyone to have light cast on them. <laughs> I mean... They can figure it out. They, figure it they, out. they figured problem. it out. Yeah. Um, it worked. <laughs> you know, may have influenced a guard to start following Mathrin, but that's neither here nor there. <laughs> there are um, always some negative consequences. It's okay. You uh, have the most fun consequences. That poor dude. <laughs> Yeah, some guard just sees you commanding the entire room and goes, this is the power of Nathan. <laughs> and he just goes, I need to rethink my life choices. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we'll come up later, we'll see. Uh, you want to go mission. home and rethink your life. <laughs> <laughs> Serve Mithrin. Um, but after uh, escorting a um, somewhat incapacitated crow and having a debrief <laughs> with the headmaster, they were able to return to the school uh, with their second mission completed successfully. And that is where we return for tonight's episode of Nice Cat. Crow, still being high as a kite. <laughs> high as a I, dragon. I really like this one. I'm not this holding is anything. She's holding a fish. <laughs> <laughs> she thinks she's holding a fish. <laughs> <laughs> she's definitely holding a fish. It's very colorful. That's what she thinks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's changing colors. It's going through every color in the rainbow yep. at one point or another. Shifting. She's like, I've never seen these colors before. I'll, I'll, I'm going to use... This one. What are the highest quality fish you have? You're going to use it for what? <laughs> fish tacos. Okay, good. Uh, five silver. Five silver. Okay. That's a, is that Cass? Is that an expensive fish? I honestly wouldn't know that. I've never bought fish before. You live at Port Caesar. Oh, right. People buy this for you. Yeah. That was Gerald usually handles that. that stuff. I just... You've never purchased a fish. No, we do. never had we, to. We probably need to. Need... All right, don't Or more. How many fish will you get? How many do you want? Seven. Seven. <laughs> Nine. Seven fish. <laughs> Seven will suffice. <laughs> I need gold, five silver. I need two more to plant for my fish flowers. What fish flowers? The ones in my room. I'll check them out later. <sighs> Alright, what else do you need to make fish tacos? Um, we. Is there fresh produce? We need a flatbread, don't we? Just gonna follow the closest thing I that suppose. looks like fresh produce. Roll me a d20. Ooh. Oh, we are gonna make them. <laughs> 12. 12? Okay, yeah. Um, there is a there is a singular other student um, that is down in town. I Are you at the Copper Captain? Or you no, just we're, we're at the market. Well, yeah, the... Cass, Cass would have avoided the copper okay. captain in favor of um, higher quality goods. <laughs> yes. Uh, there's essentially, yeah, there's produce and there's also like herbs and spices and things like that. Mm -hmm. uh, and there is a um, golden skinned tiefling, uh, uh, yellow hair, pulled back, uh, golden horns, um, going kind of straight over his head, uh, curled backwards a bit. Mm -hmm. Um, that you recognize as uh, a member of Mackenzie's team. 
uh, elder. Okay. Uh, th- this was, Mackenzie was the one we don't like, right? Yes. Okay. So he's kind of just looking over the herbs and spices at the moment. Mm. Crow definitely does not even notice him. She comes up and looks at the other things. I could get whatever I want. What a concept. Yeah. She's going to start grabbing various things. Um, not Still has not regarded his existence. <coughs> kind of just reaches up, grabs something from her side, puts it in his basket. Can you see this? It's like... I would say Aries not looks there. Looks in oh. y'all's direction. Or it, maybe showing Aerie it to is L. there. Oh, it is that. Yeah, Aries is there. It's got patterns. You may want to. It's got what? Don't sniff it to your friend. Why not? I'm keeping an eye on her. This, believe me, this sniff is the least harmless that she seems to ever be. The least harmless. Okay, the least harmful. Is there a radish? I think. Is it a radish? The thing she's harming most is currently my pocketbook. Don't leave the produce, you haven't bought it yet. We'll take that one, sorry. Crow just licked a radish. (laughs) It's like too copper. Yeah, Aerie is there and she's got the bag of holding. There you go. Nice. To put the, the fish and stuff in. Yeah, so once Crow's gotten all her things, Um, interesting enough, Elder also has a bag of folding. Nice. Um. That's the Tiefling's name? Mm-hmm. Elder, got it. Um. Can, can, does he want to make a perception or insight check on Crow? Yes, he does. <laughs> because... <laughs> He's probably glimpsed her before. She's always so brooding and serious. And now she's just relaxing, so like analyzing a vegetable. Actually. Onion or onion? Well, that one is a sweet onion, and that one is an apple. I'm not familiar with the school's policy on hallucinogenics, but, uh, you're hallucinogenic. <laughs> Excuse me? It was an accidental ingestion. No, it was not accidental. The headmaster didn't seem to make any note of it, so... I see. I'm sure if you had a problem with it, oh, you would sorry, have did you want told that? us. Yeah. Kind of happened out in the field. Mm. Fair enough. Ari does peanuts. Get... You can't put the peanuts in a fish taco. Spicy peanut sauce. No, I've I've literally done it before. It is, it's sauce. Yes. Yes, peanut sauce is a thing. Huh. Okay, so what are does... you pointing at? Yeah, she moved. Oh. Ari <sighs> does get like some Good pears. <laughs> mm, thanks. <laughs> some fresh fruit. And stuff. Yep. She gets things for herself. How does much Elder does Crow... introduce himself or anything? Or is he just? You just had a conversation with. Uh, he had a whole conversation with Cass just now that we all missed. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Little, it's fine. <laughs> totally in character, hundred percent. Exactly. The three of you just over there doing whatever. On the Cass is, Cass is watching over y'all. <laughs> Um, but how much does Crow end up gathering? Um, I think she gathers, like, a a good amount, like, a a natural amount. Not too much, not too little. I'll say, like, you bought expensive fish, Mm. but the rest of it is only going to be, like, six silver. The good fish. The good fish. Ari will drop uh, (laughs) two silver um, on 
just like general like fresh produce like fruits and like mm. stuff that she will eat yeah Restock on good things, not from the mm-hmm. copper captain. Mm-hmm. Yes. yes. Cass, make a perception roll. Oh, gosh. That is a 18. When they mentioned spicy peanut sauce, they were preoccupied, but you happen to notice L kind of look around, whip out a quick notebook, jot something down, and put it back, and you see the... Uh, title of the little notebook is uh, Cooking Recipe Ideas. (laughs) Amazing. (laughs) Well, I suppose we should go out and find that uh, spicy peanut sauce. I can make it. You can make it. All right. I think I have. Let's go get fresh ingredients. I would like some new ones because I want you to show me how to make it. Isn't that what we're doing? Getting fresh ingredients. Yes. Okay. You can knock off another, like, two silver. <laughs> Anything Press else we want to buy? Fresh bread. Oh, let's get some bread. Um, good evening, Mrs. Uh... Don't even. <laughs> Mrs. Baker. No. Mrs. Baker, yes! <laughs> Baker. No. <laughs> you can get some bread. <laughs> Soft pretzels. Mm. No. There's a pretzel stand in the market, sure. <laughs> Guess we're we'll taking that. All right, before we spend the whole session grocery shopping, <laughs> I'm Uncle set. Andrews. I don't need to keep role playing this. I am done shopping too. session. How, it's how, Uncle Andrews. How much more soft am I pretzels. Spending? Uh, like they got another silver. One silver. Yeah. <laughs> Cheapest shopping trip for cats yet. <laughs> this this uh, yeah. game. Well, I can right. change that. Yeah. If we have everything, let's go ahead and head back to the room and we can... Crow, are you sure you're fit to make yeah. the fish tacos? Oh. I'm fine. I'm the one who's going to make them. I've been wanting to uh, t- test this recipe I... for a while. Some, okay. not all. You have plenty of fish. Okay, you can what both are you make... getting at? You can both make fish I'm tacos. I'm making fish tacos. Just follow me. She said Do I make a cat? Some people can cook very well, even while high. So I'm going to argue no disadvantage. Also, Cass is going to take the lead back to the... Is Crow one of those people? And Good to know. Um, you know her background. Yeah. I don't know if I would describe her as skilled while being. She is the most relaxed and in her zone that she's been like the entire time since they showed up at the school. Okay, roll me a wisdom save. Does anyone have inspiration? No, I'm out. I have one. Please, please don't use it for this. Thank you. I'm sorry. (laughs) What'd you roll? Uh, Oh, God. I, okay, I can I can I give her lizards. can I give her help? You can give her the true. Hang on. You can have advantage given Crow's background. Okay. It's not much better. 9. Total? Yeah. That's DC 8. Yeah. She almost burns the fish. This was this was just whether or not she would have disadvantage. Oh, fair. <laughs> okay, okay, cool. It was her, about her mental faculties. Fair. fair so, so I'm gonna now, an even better roll. You have a flat roll. Mm-hmm. Are you proficient with cooking utensils? I'm not simply because I don't have enough slots for it. But if we were to go on background Bless alone, you. I would say that she has proficiency. I would, I would ask for it. <laughs> That was close. That was real close. Um, (laughs) Playing with fire. Mm -hmm. (laughs) Technically, it's water. Wind. Excuse you. Oh, yeah, that too. (laughs) (laughs) Make a wisdom check. Is sneezing just the avatar? State, you're bending all four elements. <laughs> uh-huh. Where the heck does Earth come into play? Oh, fire. Why? 
I can do better than this. What'd you roll? Five. Can I help her? You can. Yay. Yay. <laughs> what is that? This is just a wisdom wisdom check. Wisdom check. Uh, ten. That is enough. <laughs> All things considered. <laughs> yeah. Crow is just completely relaxed in the kitchen. She seems to have a very good idea of what she is doing with the ingredients that she has and all the utensils and stuff. A lot more than you would expect. Though she is stopping once in a while to just kind of watch the patterns on the grill sizzling. And then you after a while she kind of blinks and <laughs> keeps cooking. At some point. Uh-huh. Grave comes and welcomes you back. Mm-hmm. Oh, hello, Crow. Crow. She's a little uh, out of it at the moment, Grave. There you are. She keeps cooking. <laughs> I see. This is why you don't taste random things on the floor. I th- think she would have learned the last time. She will never. Okay. Good to know. All right, scoot over. By the way. It's not done yet. I know. We've made it together a hundred times. I'm making sp- spicy peanut yes, sauce this time. It's all yours. Don't <laughs> like it on mine anyway. Coward. Mm-hmm. Grave rolled a 23. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so, Very nice. between the two, with Teamwork. yours, yeah, yours was like, it was okay. You have taught Grave, though. Like, mm-hmm. he learned how to do it from you. You are just not necessarily in your right head. <laughs> That's fair. So, uh, as an extension of you, essentially. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> uh, you have fish tacos. Fish mm-hmm. tacos. Uh, I would say that by this point, a couple of hours have passed. You are sobering up. Yeah. Cass oh, definitely goodies. likes graves better. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's not like he makes some and she makes some. They kind of oh, work together. Yeah. Well, well, Cass, Cass tried one of each because Graves said he didn't like mm. it with the sauce. And so I rolled a nine but it's also 14, spicy, so. so. Yeah. You're not gonna like it. Pro- he probably wouldn't. It was it's like too white. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. It's like me. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Airy sauce doesn't really like. She kind of picks up the food and she like eats a couple bites, but it's not really like. She kind of just looks like she's generally lost her appetite. Everything all right, Airy? Hmm. Are you okay? Oh, it's not polite to speak mm. with your mouth full. Mm. Sorry. I just... I need to speak with the headmaster about something. Well, uh, mm. obviously he's back, as you are. I'm sure he's fine. You were worried that he wasn't okay earlier. No, that was you. I wasn't worried. I'm never worried about the headmaster. <laughs> Of course not. What is what does that mean? You keep saying that. Hang on. Can I make an insight to see if Crow's still actually higher if she's putting on an act? Go for it. Nope. You think she's still high? I didn't even roll for anything yet. It it was a seven. So, uh, you're welcome to. I'm sure he's mm-hmm. on in, in his office. You think he's busy? Maybe with paperwork from the mission, but nothing that can't be delayed slightly. He was our guide, so uh, if you have questions, he is the one to ask. So I don't think it would be interrupting. I think it's a good thing. All right. Can you tell us what you're wanting to talk to him about? He said he saw something and 
was confirming a suspicion he had. When did he say this? When we were waiting for you by the airship. I... I don't know, but I, I want to ask him about it. Was he talking to you when we were there? Yes. <gasps> I don't like that. You don't like the head of the school talking to a student? I guess that does make sense. But I still don't like it. You're what? just protective of her. Why? Of course I am! There's no need to be protective of me. I'm protective of uh, everyone, especially you. So the reason that uh, you have a mistrust towards the headmaster. I, of you know me, I hold no judgment. I just want to know if something's happened. Oh, something's happened. He's very powerful. Scarily powerful. Um, it's part of why he holds his position. I, I, it's, I don't, I just, there's something about him. I don't trust he gives off a weird vibe. I cannot disagree with you. He's older than you would expect. I have no idea how old he is. He wears the mask. That's partially to hide that. Is he like super old? Is he dead? I very much doubt it. I think he is yeah. filled to the brim with life, as it were. Hmm. El has no idea what he's insinuating, and but he's gonna like nod and act like he is. Do you want one of us to go with you? No. Okay. Yes. Well, I'll I'll be back in a bit. Yes. After Ari leaves, not not like specifically waiting, but just like continuing to eat. The headmaster is a unique individual. Hmm. Something that, as Crow knows, I have experience with. Because of Crow. So he is an undead? <laughs> no. Oh. Hmm. He's so good. Oh. What is L's actual? What, what what is L thinking at the moment? Okay, because um, I need to double check. Yeah, uh, what exactly? But I believe that is something around a thirty-one on insight. Oh my God. <laughs> um, I need to pull up rape sheet real quick. Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. Sorry, a 30. Oh, Minus well, then he has no idea. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, something, something weird went on with Rose's shadow on, on his watch. And there is a cover-up um, going on at the moment. And their whole shtick of we will protect you. Uh, L don't buy it. He doesn't understand the... Uh, he doesn't think that the... Leaders of the school are all, you know, righteous and totally out. We're doing this for for the right reasons or good. And he doesn't trust the headmaster because he thinks he's at the uh, head of it all. The headmaster has his faults. Uh, even I sometimes have a trouble. I have a hard time getting a read on him. Hmm. Not saying something. Don't break your arm. Never mind. <laughs> yes, because you are the picture of humility. No. <laughs> A 
for whatever faults he may have. I have never seen him act against the interests of the people under his protection. Mm, okay. As you go into the older years, you stop being under his eye as much. There are things I would not trust him with, but when it comes to keeping the students attending this school alive, if he is present, I don't think anything could stand in the way. I agree with you there. Jeez. Oh. I'm going to make some tea. And I'll get up and starts brewing a pot. So, why don't you tell me how your mission went? <laughs> oh <And> boy. <laughs> as you begin debriefing, do you tell him everything? El does. Yeah. Okay. Do you tell him that Aerie killed someone? El doesn't know that. Um, El, El, El oh. saw Crow kill someone, so El goes, Yeah, they handled it pretty well the first time, but then Crow, like, dropped him and tried to kill him. I don't know why. He didn't die. You didn't know he wouldn't die. You Even dropped him from did die, the sky. I can say from experience, it doesn't stick very well. There are ways to bring people back. Okay. It doesn't make it right. Okay. That's the problem. In a situation like that, though, we can't be sure that they're going to be willing to come back. And if we need information from them, it might be important to keep them alive. That's not my point. That's a better argument than what you've got going. Look, El, she's not going to... Doing the right thing? She's... Heroes don't kill. Who defines what a hero is? You do. I, I would say heroes don't kill needlessly. There may be times where it is required, but that is few and far between. It wasn't mm, needless. I don't see any excuse. There are circumstances. But, from what you've told me of this, it was perhaps not one of those circumstances. Yes, neither of the times Has he should have been killed. crossed a lie. Hmm? It's crossed a lie. No. Okay. She looks a little disappointed to be not high right now. <laughs> <laughs> I waited too long. Shoot. Reality. I told you Snap back. why my name is Grave. <laughs> Um, I don't know if you have gotten into the specifics, but I know you have a reverence for the dead. I do. And I have killed before. It was necessary in the moment. If I held back, other people might, may have died. There are moments in the heat of battle where... You can't afford to. Keeping in mind that it's very difficult to incapacitate someone with a spell or something like that. Thankfully, for those of you who are up well, close, physical. it will be necessary less often. But... It was never my explicit intent going into it. If there was a way in that moment to ensure that he would not harm or kill someone, I would have done that. But there wasn't. And as with every person that loses their life, he deserved a grave. So I dug him one. And I laid him to rest. And that's what I've taught Crow, that there may be circumstances where it's necessary. 
But that does not make the life you take any less meaningful. And personally, I believe that attitude is, at the very least, more practical. I don't believe I would disagree that there's never a right thing to take a life. But, sometimes principles and reality come to conflict. Mm. I don't think I agree, but I understand. Hopefully, you were never met with such a conflict. Hopefully. But... No matter what you're faced with, you must do what you believe is right. That being said, I do not believe Crow's intent was to kill. Was she careless and probably could have been a bit more? I had a reason for it. I don't doubt that. My point still stands. I did what I could. You did, and it's not like you went out of your way to finish him off, as it were. But it turned out all right. In the end, we succeeded. For now. Indeed. I do not think the ends justify the means. But... No, I'm not saying they do. I'm saying that... But I am saying that how it ended up does matter. The outcome is important, yes. Exactly. The fact is, no one lost their life today. Yes. And thankfully, no matter what else happened, that is something to be celebrated. Indeed. Thus, tacos. Exactly. Soft tacos. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, let me tell you about the part where I uh, threw Cass. <sighs> <laughs> and as you do, <laughs> Ari, you arrive at the headmaster's office. Door is closed, I assume. Obviously. Come in. Excuse me, sir. I'm wondering if you had a moment to talk. Yes, have a seat. And you notice, for the first time since attending the school, he is not currently wearing his mask. Yes! Oh! <laughs> Who is it? Who is it? Um, he has dark skin, uh, hair kind of slicked back, um, bit of a kind of helmet hair. Uh, <laughs> But uh, not anyone that you would recognize. Yeah. Um, the rest of his outfit is still the same. You walk into the office, seeing the uh, different mounted heads. Yeah. Uh, yes, Miss Vala. And she closes the door behind her. Before we left for the mission. You did something, waved that droplet of water in front of my eyes, and said that you were confirming a suspicion. Mm-hmm. Would you mind sharing with me what that suspicion was? I do not know a lot about myself, my origins. Go ahead and make a persuasion check. Ah! <laughs> Should have brought help. But, yeah. That is a flat um, ten. Twelve minus two. Yeah. What? Yeah. You should have brought help. <laughs> That's why I asked. Nothing more than a curiosity. 
Nothing that would be... I doubt it would answer any questions you have. How can I know that if I don't know what question I'm supposed to be asking? A fair point, but... Let me put it this way. It is not something that I would expect you or anyone attending this school to be aware of unless you have been informed. So it is not something you need trouble yourself with. I, I don't even want to ask to have him make an insight check because I assume he doesn't need to, to recognize that. His phrasing, especially of saying, I know something about you, but you don't need to worry about it. Yep. It is a familiar thing to Ari. Mm. Okay, I am gonna have more for that, actually. And how does she feel about that? Not good. (laughs) (laughs) What did he roll? Let's wow. go. Yeah. He Let's recognizes go. immediately that Total Aerie, of 36. Holy crap! Seems to like almost stiffen more and like start to close off. If I may. I am not attempting to hide something from you. It is a personal curiosity that I very much doubt would mean much of anything to you. But more importantly, your position your approach is flawed. What do you mean? I mean, going to anyone else to discern who you are will never give you the answers you're looking for. I was not always named Solus. I had an entire life of Adventuring, and for a while that was who I was. I took on this responsibility, and I decided who I was. I decided who I was going to be. So now I am Solus. I wasn't always airy. But I didn't get to decide who I am now. That is the entire purpose of this school, Miss Vala. Whoever you are, whoever you were, being here means you could decide who you are next. I understand. Still, though it might seem insignificant to you, I am still curious about your suspicion. Make another persuasion check. (laughs) Nat 20? Maybe. 
I'm going to use my inspiration for that because that's a one. Okay. And I'm not happy with... Was, I'm not happy with a negative one. Yeah. <laughs> the heck happens on a negative one roll? Harry is uh, dismissed from the school. <laughs> no. He didn't just, roll it. He dropped I, it. Did my usual roll. That yes. was a seven. Her usual roll. Plop. <laughs> I'm gonna roll the die. Yeah, see, <laughs> it's rolling, sweet. but it's still, you know. Maybe we should roll like that. No, don't roll like it's that. It's still oh rolling. Gosh. Yeah, it's you fair. see, they're just not try, cooperating. Hey, Trey, I'm gonna roll my die. Where roll? Hey! <laughs> that was rude. I fully expected you to put that in your mouth. I Where almost did. That's 14. <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. Anyway. Thank you. Yeah. Well, that's a 19. So, yeah. You do have one more inspiration. No, I used it. No, because she's been eating them. Oh, okay. <sighs> yeah. Come on, let's the, go. The gummies. Can I inspire her from all the way back in the room? Uh, I think it's believable Elle would have inspired her before she left. God, you're inspired. Bardic inspiration. Yeah. All right. Yeah, yeah I know. Yeah. That's, that's what I was going for. Get a good roll. All right, so roll that's it. 15. It's a military check, so you get to roll the bardic twice. And yep. the yeah, you negated your... Yep. All right, so that is a 19. Let's go! DC 15. Oh! <laughs> you would have met the DC without that. Yeah. I know, but still. It's great. I have seen a lot. Throughout the course of my life, I traveled with others. I met, I even met the heroes that would end up founding this academy. What'd you say? These eyes. <laughs> we, uh, I don't. I, I can't say this because I don't remember if it's true that they fought against that he fought against the outsiders. Yes. Are you sure? Yes. yes. You know who this is? Very. Oh yes. Yeah. I know exactly who this is. I know who this is. You you scried on him. Yeah. yeah. So they they did fight the outsiders. Like, mm -hmm. you know, that was so long ago. I genuinely don't remember. I yeah, am ninety nine percent yep. sure that they did. It's in the it's in the notes. Yep. They even fought against them in the tournament of heroes. If he's 29, what the frick is Ray? Lower. Oh man, that makes me sad. <laughs> That's your karma for your, was it 29 AC? Something like that. Higher. But Base. there's, there's we'll, we'll get to that. Let's go. One thing I found across all of my travels is that on occasion, those that have a strong soul, as it were, end up having an elemental attunement. Your teammate, Crow, from whatever she's experienced in her life, seems to be attuned to the element of fire. <laughs> And you to the element of water. I can see it reflected back. Eyes being the window to the soul and all. As I said, nothing particularly relevant, but something that I see as a curiosity. Now that. That makes a lot of sense. It makes a lot of sense. I have a connection to a quarry and have walked on the Sea of Dreams. Hmm. So, an attunement to water brings 
comfort. Thank you. With all of my knowledge and experience, I suppose even I am wrong sometimes. I'm glad that it gave you some solace. Yeah, solace. Mm. Now, is there anything else? I'm sorry that I let my emotions about the situation get the better of me, and I killed the warlock. Did you feel it was necessary? In the moment, I did. If you look back and regret it, prepare yourself better for next time. If you look back and still feel it's justified, there's no action needed. I understand. Thank you, sir. I will leave you to your work. And she will go back out. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nice. I don't know what your element is, though. Radiance, I guess. (laughs) Yeah. Uh, No. Oh, oh, like like legitimate elements? Yeah, elements? yeah what's mm-hmm. your element? His is earth. Well, I guess that means I'm air. <laughs> no. No, yours is earth. Oh, mine is mm-hmm. earth? Mm-hmm. Oh, I thought you were saying his was earth. No. No. She mm-hmm. was pointing past him. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, Elle's is light. Yep. That is correct. Wow, oh, okay. Peril was air. Yeah. It was. R.I.P. Peril. <laughs> the light nomad temples. Yeah, I remember those. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. But uh, Caspian's green thumb... His uh, oh, okay. stubbornness. That's fair. His uh, steadfastness. Steadfast. Stalwart. That's fair. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ah. <laughs> I like that. Yeah, I knew you would. Good boy. <laughs> so we discussed it as you were, uh, as we were making the characters. Yeah. <clears throat> anyway. Oh, that's right. I, I did. I did make a hero forge of him as uh, an earthbender. I forgot about that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Nice. It's also part of why it was mm-hmm. uh, Oh yeah, that makes mm-hmm. sense. Yeah. Well, that was fun. Yeah. yeah. Anyway. Um, yep. So, Ari rejoins the yeah. group. Um, Crows washing dishes yeah. at this point. Is there? So, is there a specific interaction you were doing, or just? No, that was that was okay. it. That was the conversation I wanted to have yeah, with yeah. the headmaster. Cast will wait for a moment where Crow is on her own. Mm-hmm. And he washed the dishes, so... Okay. Yep. He will approach her. Uh, Crow, mm. may I have a word? Maybe. That is <laughs> a big improvement. Well, I can definitely tell that you are sobered up. So. Unfortunately. Well, I wanted Would to make like sure... Would you like more? That... <laughs> you offering? No. Uh, apparently not. Say what you're going to say. I wanted to make sure that you would remember hearing me say this. I wanted to thank you for saving me. When I was falling. Yeah, Elle. Oh, so you do want some more. Okay, I'll be back. And Elle leaves. (laughs) Is he legit going? (laughs) No, he can read the room. Okay. Mary Kit, she's sitting on the couch. Your wisdom flip flops, my dude. We never it, it know. It really does. It really does. He is either nat twenty or nat one, a hundred percent of the time. His uh, his wisdom is a twelve, so it's not terrible. <laughs> yeah, that's, it just that's comes down to does he use it? Do you use it? <laughs> no, not always. It's great. Exactly. And why are you thanking me? Because it matters to me. What does? <laughs> <laughs> you saving me? It's... It was literally just our job. Well, look, if you don't want the team and the mission to fall apart, you look after each other. It's not that big a deal. While you're not entirely wrong, there's more to it than that. 
Maybe. I think you're looking into it too much. Maybe. You have been rather standoffish, and perhaps that's why it stands out to me that you would have gone out of your way to help me. Look, if I want to have an attitude, I'm going to pick a time where it matters. All I'm saying, Crow, is I appreciate what you did. I wanted you to know that. It means something to me. So, thank you. I owe you one. I know I'm going to regret saying that, but... I mean... I don't need favors or anything. Uh-huh, sure. Well, I'm sure you'll still find some way to cash in on that. Probably when it's most inconvenient for me. But... Is that all you have to say? <laughs> it's right. uncomfortably gushy. <laughs> Very well. I will leave it at that. But did you like the tacos? Actually, I did. I've never had something like that before. Yeah, it was my favorite growing up. Huh. Even... Taught Grave how to make it. That's <laughs> why he helped. Well, I do appreciate you making them for us. Whim of the moment. <laughs> Whim of the moment. To make a good recipe, you can't just make a single serving, you know? No, I'm afraid I don't. I've never really set foot in the kitchen. Except to try and steal some snacks here and there, and I usually get rushed out of the room. The hell you mean you've never stepped in a kitchen before? <laughs> what do you mean? Never. What do I mean? I've I've never really like I've never cooked. Like That's obvious. <laughs> and you're here at a school of heroes trying to be an independent adult to help other people and you can't cook. I'm that's I'm, shockingly embarrassing. Well, I feel like the only reason you would tell me that is because you're simply not bright enough to realize how stupid of a thing that's. What, what do you mean that's stupid? I always had somebody to cook for me. Every meal was was made. Oh, rich people and spoiled rituals. I'm not gonna keep cooking for you every day if you're no, that's looking why, for that. That's why I usually go out to eat or buy something. Have you never noticed that I just don't cook? We, we've been at the school for months. Well, yeah, neither have I. I haven't been eating. Oh, well... <laughs> I guess I eat more than you do? Yeah, I've honestly hardly ever seen you eat this period. I guess I just figured you always hid in your room to eat, or just maybe, I don't know, siphoned the life force off of other people. <laughs> <laughs> <You're wrong. laughs> right, well. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> <laughs> I'll check, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> well, maybe one day I'll learn to cook. But so you're far, I guess say I that, and you're gonna keep saying that until it finally happens. All right, well, are you volunteering to teach me? If you don't burn my food, seems like Elle's ready to cook food, too. Maybe you can do the world a favor and learn how to cook like a normal, regular person. Since when have you been concerned with people being normal, regular people? You're certainly not regular. Neither are you. Who are you to judge? You can't even cook. <laughs> And you're a virgin. <laughs> I'm sorry? Grave. Still no sitting at the table. <laughs> next I'm sorry. Ari is sitting next Rave, to Grave. Still sitting at the table, reading a book, doesn't even look up and says, Crow, most people your age are. I'm sorry for you too. <laughs> What? Never mind. I'm, I'm... 
You are an enigma to me. 99% of the time. Good, let's keep it that way. <laughs> I don't like being known. <laughs> She's not lying. That does make sense. Crow, if you're teaching Caspian to cook, can I teach you how to read? Oh, no. yeah, speaking of things normal people can do... <laughs> just saying. For throwing it out there. Uh, I'm kind of sad I'll what, miss no this. comeback, Sassy? Maybe I didn't have a wonderful education like some of you guys to be able to read things that aren't even relevant to me. I don't need to. So what does it matter? You know, I think you Grave doesn't find... even read right. from his book okay. over there. Alright, how about this? He flips around, he's actually reading a book this time. Gary <laughs> <Okay. laughs> Look. looks over at the book to try and determine what it is. Oh no. <laughs> With, since you saw it last time, you do see that there is a false cover. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Ari wasn't there last night, that was L. Oh, oh Mr. that's true. Yeah. Uh, you pass perception 21, you see yeah. a false cover. Yeah. Oh, From living with... I've read that one. Grave. <laughs> I'm sure you have. <laughs> <laughs> you are well aware. Yes. <laughs> Look. How about this? Make a deal. I'll learn to cook, and you learn to read. Uh-uh. <laughs> Alright. Suppose that's too much for you. Ooh. And be grave to it. <laughs> <laughs> Cass has found his sass. <laughs> so what you're saying is whoever gets it first. <laughs> Competition. Maybe. All right, what are the rules for the competition? No rules, but it has to be legit. Can't be using magic illusions or whatever. Cheating, have someone else cook for you. You gotta learn it, you gotta do it. And how do you define when he's learned how to cook? What if he's willing to serve it to the headmaster? Yeah. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I would need to be really good before I was willing to do that. Uh, uh, exactly. Alternate proposition, if I may. I like that idea, but sure. Y yes, I'm sure you do. There are... Seven weeks until summer break. When you come back from summer break, we'll have a test. You'll try to read something, you'll try to cook something. And based on myself and your teammates, or perhaps uh, Team A, we'll decide the judges, and uh, whoever's done a better job, assuming me, nil starting point, will be the winner. Sure. All right. I'm not teaching you, though. Find someone else. No, oh, that's all right. I'd rather be taught by L. <laughs> yeah, you wouldn't be able to handle it. Does L know how to cook? Oh, yeah, he does. Oh, no. We rolled for this. He that's rolled after 20. Nice. That's right. L can cook. It's more like, despite his pranks, I think I'd still rather endure them than your sunny disposition. <laughs> You're missing out. <laughs> sure. Uh -huh. So who do you want to teach you how to read? You offered. Okay, I'll okay. gather a list right. of books. Also, guys versus girls. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Poor elf. <laughs> How are we gonna slaughter them? Crow's gonna learn the Arkland Arkland's equivalent of Shakespeare. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> oh, you poor thing. <laughs> Shakespeare's actually pretty easy. A lot of it rhymes. Hmm. Start with Doctor Seuss. <laughs> <laughs> All right, green We're going to make in. things that taste good. Yes, sir. I will bring back well, supplies. We're going to make my papa's favorite crumb muffins. Amazing. <laughs> 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 uh, so. Al does return with the ingredients for muffins. Amazing. Mm. Ca Cass, is, Cass and Elle are going to bond yeah. a little bit. Yeah. yeah. They're actually going to do something where Cass is not constantly being attacked. Yeah, he still will. <laughs> What's oh. that? Oh my that? gosh, that was for the crud muffins. <laughs> nice. 
19 and 18. <laughs> nice. The heck do I add to it? Performance? I would add wisdom. Okay, it's a non natural 20. Good gracious. Yeah. Why are you rolling with, the, with advantage? I don't know. It's out of the way. <laughs> oh, so it's a 19. Right. Still good. Very good. Uh, do you have proficiency with cook's utensils? No, which I, I think was dumb to do, but I, it only gave me one. Yeah, proficiency. There's not a lot of options. Yeah. You have astronomers tools, but not. I need to fix that. It's mm -hmm. not accurate. We can give you cooks tools instead of astronomers. Yeah. Like I get why you had astronomers, but like knowing how to use a telescope and astronomers tools are two different things. Correct. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you can add your proficiency. That means. Cool. Oh, actually, even then you could add half your proficiency because it's a skill check. So that would be a plus four then, at the moment, right? Because we have a plus three, yeah. So, 22. No, we have a plus two proficiency. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, one for wisdom, and then half, which runs up to one. Well, again, you're proficient with cooking tools, right. so plus three total. Oh, plus three, okay. Okay. Yeah. You so don't yeah. add proficiency and then half proficiency. I don't know what I'm doing. Don't worry about <laughs> it. It's late. They're good. It's above a 20. It's yes. They're good. So, the next few weeks of school, mm -hmm. um, so I'm not going to have y'all roll, well, okay, for the next three weeks, we'll say, you make a, um, yeah, so wisdom. Oh, three course, or three, so three course, not three course. A meal with three things: meat, you know, side, and side. We're, we're, we're no. start. No, no, no. We're starting with fried eggs. Oh, okay. There you go. There you there go. go. So you're gonna make a fried eggs, bacon, and toast. Flat okay, intelligence a, check. Very easy. Sure. And you'll make a flat wisdom check. Okay. Very, very easy. Flat Cass three. is not good at making uh, any eggs or anything. That's a six. <laughs> okay. First week does not go well. So for the first, well, we'll say this like the first two or three, but. Um, Flat 20. Yeah, flat 20. No, okay. Uh, <laughs> you mark down two. Two. Two successes. Yeah. There's a zero. Yeah. This will be the modifier, just um, at the end. What? I kind of want to give you bardic inspiration. <laughs> you can. You're helping him. That's true. You can have it for each roll. Okay. Cool. Uh, it's, not gonna, it's not gonna help you out here with a sick. We'll, we'll do, we'll do it might roll be. for every two weeks, but... That's a six, so that's twelve. Twelve. Mark down one. Hey, that's exactly. a pass. Okay, yeah. never mind. Thanks, buddy. These are skill we're checks too, so you get to roll to twice. Read comments. You don't have to. You, you don't yeah. have to. Yeah. Read. yeah. Just Can't, comment. Are we comments. not throwing <laughs> writing in at all, or no? Just that reading. was not the. Was not nope. Discussed. Just reading. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Crow's gonna in grab addition, handwriting because she's never practiced. Uh, if you could roll for your classes. Okay. Ooh. Yep. That's right. Insight. Oh. All right. Get? All right. It not wait. Was that the dice I rolled? I thought that was the dice I rolled. I think it was this one. I don't know which one you rolled. Sorry. Can't I'm pretty me. sure. I, I'm going to say it was that one because I'm pretty sure it was. It rolled into my others and knocked everything around. Ah. But that's a one. Oof. 21. 21. So that's one success yep. for you. And then I lose uh -oh. a point, right? Yeah. yeah. You do. Oof. Got 23. Uh, 23. Ooh, Ca nice. Cass is too focused on the competition <laughs> yep. with cooking that half the time in class is like, huh? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> right, right. How what is Crow's approach to... Any new or updates on how to integrate the dragon scales? Yeah, I think by this, you know, you spent a few weeks trying to kind of figuring it out. Mm -hmm. Is How specifically do you want to integrate them? <laughs> the hope is to, well, I had been looking into the idea of um, adding fire to my attacks mm -hmm. with just fire on the wings, not them heating up, not them blasting motes of fire, but just okay. they're on fire. Sure. Um, I don't really know how the magic would work, but some kind of that idea of invoking e a fire dragon's, um, yeah. Okay. A, Dragon's yep. fire to go ahead and make wings. an arcana check. Okay. Uh, that is a math thirteen. Thirteen is not a success. Sad. Mm. So that's a fail. Um, no, but it's just like you don't add one. Okay. <clears throat> yeah. Um, 
And so that was week 14. Uh, and because I know that you are, especially uh, Elle and Ari, have been keeping an ear to the ground, as it were. Mm. I rolled randomly for this. Oh boy. Another team encountered a pale beast. <gasps> the blood thickens. Yeah. Which Mackenzie's team. <gasps> oh! I rolled ah. randomly. Ah, yeah. ah! Why did it have to be them? I mean, I love it. But Cass would be like, why? <laughs> yep. So it is up to you whether or not you want to ask them about it. What else? Aries focus on teaching Crow how to read at the moment, so. Okay. Crow wouldn't know. Oh, if yeah. Elle is going to ask them out, Ari will kind of hang around him. Has Elle debriefed the rest of the team about the interaction over oh, yeah. the break? Nope. <laughs> of course not. Uh, Really? This is coming down <laughs> to like those shows where it's like everything could be solved if there's just clear communication. Yeah. This is what's happening. This is my least favorite trope. <laughs> and yet we've all been doing You know, it. it's ironic because it's my favorite. <laughs> I love it. Secrets. Because it's Aerie so has shared do this. Secrets. And they it's done on would purpose. Would be relevant to the Just to aggravate people. <laughs> and it's beautiful yep. to me. <laughs> uh, and it, it makes perfect sense for L too. To just not say anything. But it would also make sense for him to just dump all the info. So it's very flip floppy. You rolled a natural 20 for something. I did roll a natural 20 for something. What for? Let's see if you forgot about it. <laughs> forgot about what? The uh, the whole. Challenging death? Yeah. See if I forgot about no, it? No, see, see if Al forgot uh, about it. Has it been it is burned enough? into his memory. He has not forgotten. In fact, uh, you have disadvantage on your next roll, because Elle spends a little bit more time in the forge than he does teaching you. Well, okay. Cast would probably supplement with Grave, because okay. he knows that Crow taught Grave. Crow taught Grave. So much as having been there when the deal was made, considers L your tutor and Aaron. Oh. He will teach me. Oh, but Crow can't okay. get help from anyone else either. Mm-hmm. Okay, you have your help that's from fair. your that's teammate. Fair. Yeah. Cass will just have to practice Grave on his own then. Would would normally be <laughs> so down and willing and would love to, <laughs> but he respects the challenge. I cannot interfere. You know that's true. Sure, sure, it was a natural twenty. Should we punish that? I will tell you what I, I'm going to do is that that will come back later. Okay. Uh. And the disadvantage for him gives you one inspiration. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'll, I'll take, take it. it. <laughs> Use that right. inspiration you're to you're re-roll. So, so am I rolling for the inspiration? Now? Go. Yes. Do, I, do I get the bardic inspiration? So, okay, yes. Uh, this, this doesn't... Yeah, this doesn't uh, affect it. Not yet, because we're going to have you guys rolling for those things every two weeks. Okay. okay. So first, classes. Another okay. thing classes. Yeah. Kinda, uh, you, know, you know the drill. Okay. Nice. That's unfortunate. I always hit a 20 on that. That's Okay, that's uh, a success. It's not wasted. Okay, good. That's a 13. Cool. Oh, Mark's success. Eight. One Total? Three. Yeah. On Arcana? I rolled a three. Oh. Yeah. We all have bad weeks. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. Not me. 19. <laughs> <laughs> Pass. 12. Pass. And 13. Yeah, yeah. Cool. All right. Week 16. Mm-hmm. Uh, We've been doing this since week 10, right? Uh... Technically, it's 11, but yeah. All right, so we've made five or six rolls. Five. You've made four because you didn't make one the week of your mission. Then how come I've written down five checks? I believe you had two successes at one point. Yep. No, you and I both rolled that 20. Yeah, I've, I've no, rolled that 20. You said we only get two successes if we get a nat 20. Yeah. Correct. Maybe you... Because you started in week 11. Mm-hmm. Two... We could always go back and review. It's fine. Yeah. I assume we're not making no, our final have. checks tonight. No. Nah. Yeah. So nah. um, we have time. Yeah. We'll figure yeah. it out. We'll figure so, it out later. Week 16. Uh, it is the second month of summer. 
in zero Ooh. has started. So, roll for your classes. All right. 18. Oh, yes. no! You also got one? Okay, good. He has some. That's Ooh. another fail. Was that, wait, wait. Was <laughs> that the inspiration you just <laughs> Oh, that's the inspiration you just got for me. That's much better. <laughs> it's a 20-something. Only one success, but... 13. 19 on the die. Wait a second. After two to three weeks of... Wait, I have one inspiration? Kind on, of on. getting stuck on things. I use my insight inspiration. Oh, that's right. Yeah. That's what we use for You it. guys have one per. Yeah. Yep. So instead of using mm. my actual inspiration, I use the insight okay. inspiration. Okay. Yep. Also, I didn't realize I had an inspiration. Um, you sure that's not your insight inspiration? Nope, that's a different one. I have oh. them separated. Uh, I've, I've been writing them in my notes. Can I re-roll that uh, insight one? Would you get a net one? Yeah. Oh, I mean, it's up to you. No, because it makes it, it made sense. Okay, that's fair. Yeah, I will um, hold that for another time. You, yeah, you do have access to the to um, Idris as a resource. Yeah. In the oh, lab, yeah, so you could this. attempt to like. I fully believe Crow would go for multiple weeks before asking for help, mm-hmm. but it is an option. Yeah, I think eventually he would. So when is when is eventually? Uh, this week. Okay. Do you want to do it this week? If if she's run into two fails at this point, she's getting really frustrated. Okay. So then go ahead and roll again with advantage. Okay. There we go. Uh, that is flat twenty. Flat twenty. Yeah, it just comes in and kind of just like helps you because he is a wizard. Mm-hmm. Spellcraft is his thing. Yeah. Um, so you absolutely get uh, a bit of a boost, mm-hmm. and he helps you so you can mark down the success for that week. Okay, so would that be removing the fail that I just got for week for week sixteen? Okay, so you have a success, not a fail. Cool. Thank you. Yep. That is cool. Uh, week seventeen. Uh, for once, y'all are not going out of missions. Uh, for the first week, but first, uh, reading and cooking. Okay. Uh-huh. So, disadvantage. Do I get I mean, can... But you have disadvantage, can I you have to roll try again. and help oh, her did, by... Oh, that's right. Given the... Right, well, let me, let me hold you that. guys teaching them is giving them the chance to okay, roll so at all. Okay. okay. So there would not Why be... Why is it wisdom lower. and not intelligence? That would have been such Yours a good is intelligence. That oh, it is... is. Okay, yeah. For some reason. <laughs> We're doing well, a lot of checks. wisdom. It's not bad. Uh, that is a 13. So. Yeah, 12. Pass, pass. Cool. All right. Cool. Um, so week 17, y'all are not going on a mission because you're mm-hmm. going on a mission in the second week. Mm-hmm. Um, and then classes. Yep. So is week 17 downtime or just classes? Classes. Okay. Oh. Just making sure. Yeah. Ooh, that's not good. What happened that week? Uh... Do I have an ins- No, I've used all my inspirations. <sighs> Here. I got it back, so go for it. Because a nat one on this is really bad. So. Okay. Did you have one more? Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. He did. Because he used his inspiration. Insight. That's right. That's right. Uh, yeah. Insight. Yeah. Inspiration. So, she can have that one. All right. Well. It's just on that one. Yep. That's an 11. <gasps> That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. All right. Nice. Better for, than a one. For y'all, the DC is 10. The, yep, yep. The only one that has a higher one is Crow. Cool. So, Ooh. did you... That's a 17. 17? You're good? Yep. Was that for class? Done. That was for classes, right? 100 mm-hmm. total. All right. So, we come to week 18. Oh, boy. Lucky week 18. Mm-hmm. Um, <laughs> and so, the five teachers are Silver, Douglas, Samira, Sigalora, and morning. Uh, so, I presume you remember who they all are. I remember Samira. I remember Silver. I presume nothing. nothing. Yes. <laughs> Silver is your combat technique teacher uh-huh. with the white hood. Okay. He's the one that does Tifa. the missing an eye. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Douglas is the leader of House uh, Meram, mm-hmm. the one in the wheelchair. Mm-hmm. Samira. Lion, lioness Barbarian. Mm. With the cool swing, yep. hit <laughs> distance. Yeah. Sigalora. Ranged like melee. Yep. Ranged melee, yeah. Which uh, doesn't make sense. Sigalora, leader of House Kaio, the 
salamander, yep. mm -hmm. fire mm -hmm. elemental. Mm -hmm. no, and mourning is the uh, yellow skinned tiefling um, that is uh, one of your uh, utility teachers. Okay. She's, she's not the insight one, is she? No, no, no that's not. Bakar. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but you do know uh, that uh, for these missions, in addition to choosing a teacher, you may also uh, know some of the details before you choose. Silver will be leading a um, infiltration mission on an island in the Myrian Ocean. Douglas will be leading a strike mission, as it were, to stop a creature that appears to be on a rampage emerging from a dungeon in the Daikun Step. Samira has been sent on a retrieval mission. Some enemies have escaped. Some combatants have escaped local law enforcement and are taking refuge in a ancient structure and need to be retrieved. Fetch quest. Uh, cool. Also is... in the Marian Ocean. Okay. Sigalora is on a reconnaissance mission to locate a site of interest in Almasatar, which you would know is the Northern Kingdom in Vala. Mm. And last but certainly not least, Morning will be assessing the damage dealt by a creature in uh, Northern Mire. Cass perks up a little bit at that. Mm. I, uh, I'm going to check that one out. Which, oh, which one? The last sure. one. And the north, uh, uh, are, are we allowed to... Are to are of course. Ocean right, Cass is going to walk up to the morning. He's already gone. Step. Yeah. Um, Masatar, pardon me. Or Where exactly in northern talking to morning? To morning, yes. Yeah. Um, the... That's the one where they only like elves, right? Yeah. I you don't want to I have a feeling knowing this will either ensure you want to pick it or mm -hmm. ensure you don't. Uh, your father has asked for help. <gasps> guys! Guys! <laughs> I can't, I can't do exactly that. Guys, guys, we have to do this one! What? Which one is this? This this one is in Port Sita. This is my home. This is, my dad requested yes, this. From Hugo Tennant. Hugo. We should go. <laughs> you guys can you guys can come and you can we can stay at my house. We stay at you our estate. You want Crow to meet your family. <laughs> <laughs> that is a good point. It's no no enough. We'll do this lesson. We'll, we'll do this. I'd love to meet your family. You could cook for us. You could that is true. Us. You oh can my show gosh, them I'm your skills. beginning to realize this might be a horrible idea. <laughs> you can step into your kitchen for the first time and cook. Oh my gosh, Gerald will you have an a... aneurysm. <laughs> I like this mission. Who's I Gerald? Like my butler. Butler. Oh my gosh. What does so that mean? So I presume mean? you'll be coming with me. Absolutely, yes. Yes. I, I, despite it all, I would still... I would still very much like to go home. Do you need a tour of your own kitchen? Everyone, Possibly. Everyone <laughs> needs a tour of a new kitchen. Considering that the kitchen first. does have multiple parts to it. <gasps> yes. You you will enjoy it. I will. Is I it will a fancy about. kitchen? Do you have a library as well? We do. Could continue your lessons and you could read. We have lots of things. I guess, but we're on a mission. Yes. A mission that is about assessing the damage dealt. The urgency is minimal. And we've completed our last two missions within a day or two. This one would be nice to kind of slow down. I have 
no problem with that. We can either leave later tonight or in the morning. Up to you. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm ready whenever. Good. Uh, let's wait until the morning. <laughs> I'm so kidding. Mean. We can leave now. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I don't even a have a. I d- uh, yes. I don't even have a bag to pack. It's all right. We've got stuff. Actually, uh, we have enough rooms for all of you. Need to prepare. So, we will leave at nightfall. Very well. Do you have the fast ship? Every teacher here does. Huh. This has much has been stated. Then why were okay. some teams so slow to leave and get to their location first week? Not because everyone wants to go immediately. Why? Preparation. Various reasons, I guess. Yeah, mentally prepare. Some people prepare. have things. I, I wouldn't understand that. And sometimes the missions are not supposed to start until later in the week. Oh. Interesting. Especially if it is not an urgent matter. And this one is not... Apparently, there was some sort of... large wolf. Monstrous in size. Was it pale? Uh, not that I'm Covered aware. in mushrooms? I, white wolves are a... Fairly common phenomenon. We have a way of hearing Oh, okay. Her. I just wanted to make sure it wasn't related to we do? death. You've never seen her before. No. Technically, she's not white. She'd be like gray. Okay, the hero report was white at one point. It's like whitish gray. It's an off white. Anyway, it was white. Yeah. It's eggshell. This is green. If there are any connections, I am certain we will be able to find them when we investigate. But regardless, we'll leave at nightfall. Um, we'll meet back here. Alright. Yeah. Go and get ready and I will see you here this evening. Sounds good. You've never been right. to shipper. He's going home. It's a good yeah. thing to go home. This is like, a, a, you know, I mean, it's not a vacation, but I mean, you know, it's nice to go home. I mean, you hear in your head, maybe not for those two. So... Well, we'll have a good time. Yes. If we finish early, we can spend some time perusing. You'll get to read in the library. I get to use a magnificent kitchen. Mm-hmm. I'm so excited. Uh, well, I'll have to get permission for you to use it. I'm sure I can. But, you know. I can get us permission. You can try. I will. And as you go and prepare for your exciting homecoming. You're shaking the entire sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> the mic's <laughs> out. That is where we will end tonight's session. Though with one, um... Stinger? Oh, here we go. Really? What would be the, what would be the word, the term here? I don't know, what are you trying to convey? Depends. Let's find At the- that same moment, okay. half a continent away, Port Seether, in all its glory, standing at the northern tip of the continent. A cloaked figure on a pale steed you! approaches the city. You have brought this upon my land! No! And that is where we will end tonight's episode. You. <laughs> Thank you very much for joining us. I... It... Depends on what the schedule is. There may be a uh, short break before we're able to uh, return with, with more episodes, but we will certainly see you soon. Good night, everyone.